Since ancient times, the need to have a suitable house has been one of the human requirements. With the advancement of technology and the development and expansion of human needs, the definition of a suitable home has also changed. For now, it can be said that a suitable house is a house that, in addition to having the basic facilities of life, has facilities such as proper lighting system, optimal heating and cooling system, and efficient security and protection systems. In addition to the things we have said, today the issue of optimal management and control of all electrical and mechanical equipment inside the house, which are related to the comfort and living facilities, lighting, cooling and heating systems and security, has been raised. This efficient management and control can provide a modern, comfortable, safe and optimal way of life for humans in addition to meeting the basic needs of life. The result of this debate today has led to a new innovation in the home building industry called the smart home. A smart home is a home in which all devices and devices are controlled remotely through the Internet of Things and through mobile phones or network devices, and there is no need to control and do many tasks manually. Also, by making the building intelligent to perform a set of tasks at the same time, by giving scenarios to the home systems, the necessary commands can be programmed for that event to occur. For example, when a guest enters using the guest program, the corridor lights will be turned on, the hall light and the lighting system of the hall and home will be suitable for the party, and maybe a soft music will be played. With the things we have mentioned, the purpose of smart home construction can be mentioned as follows. Providing maximum comfort and well-being for life by simplifying and automating many tasks at home, which leads to saving time. Optimizing energy consumption as well as increasing the life of home equipment, all of which lead to a reduction in living costs. Increasing the amount of life security. To achieve these goals and build a smart home, we need equipment that is actually called smart home components. Central controller. Central controllers are actually the heart of the intelligent system. All components of the smart home are connected through this device and all commands are sent to different components of the home through that. This central device is like the offensive player of the smart home. It receives information from the devices at home and controls everything is in there. Communication protocols. In order for different parts of the smart home to easily communicate with each other and with the central controller, it is necessary to have a clear and defined communication path. The communication protocol is actually a standard and acceptable way for all parts of the system to exchange information between themselves. These communication paths can be wireless or hardwired. User Interfaces Smart home user interfaces are actually tools that smart home users can utilize to communicate with the home. These tools range from the smart remote control that replaces all remotes in the house to smart keys, touch screens, or the same mobile phone and tablet that everyone uses. With the help of these tools, you can easily command the smart home or apply simpler programs to them yourself. Sensors There are tools that can prepare reports on different conditions of the house such as light, temperature, humidity, or the presence of smoke, and by sending these reports to the central controller, enable the application of pre-programmed scenarios. For example, when the temperature rises to a certain level, the cooling system turns on automatically. Actuators. There is equipment through which an operation can be controlled such as switching relays or dimmers, which can be used to control the lighting intensity in the lighting system circuit. Or hot or cold water flow path valves that are used to control the temperature in the heating and cooling system and also, the servo motors that are used to control the opening or closing of the curtains, as well as electronic locks that are used to close or open doors. Now we want to talk about the features of smart homes. Smart lighting. Electronic switches, relays, and dimmers are devices that are added to the house to enter the lamps and lighting of the house into the smart system. One of the benefits of smart lighting is energy consumption management. Especially, according to statistics, about 30% of the electricity consumption of each country is related to the lighting sector. With smart lighting, you can activate many preset programs at home. For example, have a lighting program for playing a movie or when a guest enters the house, or a key or button on the mobile phone that turns off all the lamps when you leave the house. Smart ventilation and remote cooling and heating control. 
In most smart homes, it is possible to use existing heating cooling equipment such as air conditioners, splits, fan coils, some smart fireplaces and underfloor heating systems and integrated with the smart home system. For example, people who have a villa or a house in another city that they are not in for a long time of the year, they can turn on the cooling heating system before entering the villa so that the temperature is suitable when they enter the villa. Smart Security System With the help of smart home user interfaces, you can also control security parts such as burglar alarms, temperature, light and motion sensors. You can check videos or photos from security cameras and use simple security scenarios for greater efficiency and peace of mind. Smart TV and Home Cinema In a smart home, playing movies and home cinema is an important part. One of the most important benefits of this integration is that there is no need for different remotes for different devices such as TV, DVD player, and satellite and all devices are controlled with the smart home remote. In addition, the possibility of playing movies anywhere in the house from a networked hard drive improves the experience of watching movies for residents of smart homes. Control and play music. Playing music from a mobile phone or a network hard drive, grouping songs, and free music streaming services are part of the smart home features in the field of music. It should also be added that the logic of the aforementioned equipment control operation is performed by a software system that performs this operation in three stages. Data collection. Sensors, cameras, microphones, and IoT devices collect information about the home environment. Data processing. The collected data are sent to the central processing unit, stored and analyzed to make decisions based on the information. For example, temperature and humidity data can generate notifications for the cooling and heating system. Implementation of actions. The process data leads to the implementation of actions, such as controlling household appliances, reducing the temperature of the heating system or closing the curtains. Regarding the advantages of smart homes, for items can be mentioned. Convenience and being under control of home appliances, the most important effect of which is saving time. Optimum energy consumption, which is very important to reduce costs. Providing more safety and security. Providing an easy and luxurious life. Smart homes like other new technologies, have disadvantages. Of course experts and engineers are still eliminating or minimizing these disadvantages. High initial cost. The design and supply of equipment and construction of this type of house is currently much more expensive than ordinary houses. Privacy concerns. Due to the use of Wi-Fi network system as well as IoT, some people are worried about the threat of privacy. The complexity of compatibility with smart equipment. This issue is now very serious for the elderly. Basically, some say that the use of this type of house is more suitable for young and middle-aged people because these people have more ability to learn and adapt. Smart home technology is expanding due to the mentioned benefits and it is predicted that by 2050 it will occupy a large share of the housing construction market. Children and young generation should be prepared to use this technology. If you like this video, like it and share it with your friends to support us. Also subscribe to our channel to see our future videos. Thank you for being with us and supporting us.